with the absolute state of the economy, are we going to see a repeat of something like Occupy Wall Street or are people too demoralized? The people are whatever they're told to be. A merry golems will never threaten their masters. Nah they learned from last time, nothing gets accomplished by protesting. They drink champagne, laugh at you and sending their subverters in to fracture any movement. This time it's going straight to violence like someone walking into Milos and greasing a whole effing swath of hedge fundies slash SEC slash JP slash Goldman guys during lunch. Not even close definitely way too demoralized vaxxed and cognitively dissonant. The average leftish is now basically a corporate chill golem. I don't know where all the Occupy Wall Street types went but they simply don't exist anymore. Definitely, Americans are going to get increasingly pissed off this year as they see their purchasing power diminish for essential goods as they keep hearing that the stock market is booming. By this summer Congress will haul Jerome's butt onto Capitol Hill to ask him what the heck he thinks he's doing crashing the US dollar so GameStop stock can moon. Normies will never do anything again. All of the energy that could be used to care about how badly they're getting effed by the government or Wall Street has been harmlessly redirected towards social media culture war bickering. Nobody's gonna do squat when there's a debate on gas stoves or deep fake porn to keep tabs on. Even if things do get bad enough to where people can't afford food they'll just default to harmlessly blaming the formless abstraction of the opposing party slash wing for everything. The hippie dippy shit show of OWS was quickly dispatched and its members were turned into obedient global homo lapdogs when they started becoming a minor annoyance. We're seeing it now in the UK coming soon to the rest of the world. Strap in because we're in for a decade of industrial action and civil unrest. Social media has destroyed society. Everyone will just sit at home and type into their crappy phones making the owners of these platforms even richer, they financialized every aspect of society. Liberals are the party of corporations now. They'll call you a conspiracy theorist for not giving effing Pfizer a rim job now. Occupy Wall Street got infiltrated really fast and it suffered the same problem that none of these other grassroots have which is that they'll never call the enemy by name. Any protest you see is corporately organized and funded. Why do Zoomers think Occupy actually did anything? People thought those guys were dead beats and losers. I think with the internet the way it is now it would be way more interesting Biden would have to send the National Guard to bash hippie skulls in. Protesting accomplishes nothing, if it did happen it would lead to the social justice warrior progressive stack, turning it from an economic protest to something about race and gender. This planet is under a proxy extraterrestrial occupation. Some country in Europe used orbital satellites to take pictures of people's houses across the country from space and fed the data to AI that auto-targeted people who had pools in their backyards without a licenses and were auto-fined. What this means is that we aren't in Kansas anymore. I can't profit from hobos in parks playing hacky sack fucko. My money occupies Wall Street. The only real revolt was in 1830 by the proletariat. The revolt in the 70s was a joke, the revolt in 2012 was pathetic. No too many forms of voluntary sedation at our fingertips. People are also different now and lack the ability to congregate in secret to form groups for this sort of thing, most millennials don't own property to foster community. People get filled with race slash gender slash religion BS so they won't come to the conclusion what the real problem in this world. So no, they will just increase the race slash gender slash religion BS instead.